I have to be honest, up until the whole controversy started at the end of last year, I had never even heard of Andrew Tate. But shortly after New Year's, I was at a party with a few friends, and a couple of them commented on Andrew Tate. We then proceeded to watch his theatrics on YouTube, and I myself did some research on him. After doing so, I came to this one conclusion. This guy cannot be for real. There's just no way, and I'm going to prove that Andrew Tate is a troll. Yeah. This is what I think. Yeah. Now, once I've upset them, sure, I'll twist the knife, you know? <laughs> <laughs> once everyone's crying their eyes out, you know, well, I'll, then, I'll, then it's fun, then it's just like salt in the wound. <laughs> to go into the definition, what is an online troll? A person that deliberately posts provocative messages in the hopes of causing argument and disruption. Now, Andrew Tate definitely excels in these fields. Say a lot of stuff about women like that they're your property. That's not what I said. I was talking about an OnlyFans company when that was question was asked. But okay. I said that if a woman is going out with a man, she belongs mm -hmm. to that man. That's his woman. So if she wants to do OnlyFans. She owes him some money because she's his. Little electric, my little plug. Ooh, let, me, let me get my little plug and plug it into my Tesla. Ooh, maybe I can get an erection one day. Is this the man you want? Get in the cage. <laughs> I'll show you what toxic is. Your wife can watch from somewhere at the back. This is Romania. We got beautiful women around. She's gonna be like hot chicks around. She has to be in a burka or something. Respect the cock. And tame the cunt. But there are plenty of other attributes to trolls, and each one can be applied to Andrew Tate. I'm not alone in this, as many will state that he's just melodramatic, too over-the-top even by far-right activist standards. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to point out that his rants are staged and satirical. Last thing on Earth I am is dumb, all right? That's the last thing on Earth Doesn't I am. look like it. Listen, you you sucked off a fucking basketball team. And what? And what? How does that make me dumb? My head because gave... My paid. brain is crazy! <laughs> you did it for free! Just look at the South Park-like skit he made when responding to Greta Thunberg. Greenhouse gases. I'm obviously a stranger to online controversy. It's not something I often do. But now, the mainstream press is commenting on the fact that I was informing Greta that my very extensive car collection with internal combustion engines, which run on dead dinosaurs, have an enormous emission profile. And she replied by telling me her own email address. Greta's email address is, I have small dick energy. Why would that be your own email address, Greta? Strange. I mean, also, I don't want to assume her gender. It's 50-50, but it is what it is. I'm not actually mad at Greta. Please bring me pizza and uh, make sure that these boxes are not recycled. Thank you. So I'm not actually mad at Greta. Right? Because she doesn't realize she's been programmed. She doesn't realize she's a slave of the matrix. She thinks she's doing good. Someone has sat her down and convinced her to try and convince you to beg your government to tax you into poverty to stop the sun from being hot. And then, because I called her out on it, the global matrix got this bot farm to like and retweet and all this bot commenting to try and pretend that her telling me that she has a small dick in her own email address somehow teaches me a lesson. Welcome to a new episode of The Clown Show. But now I know at least that Greta, with a little hate-filled face, bitter, sitting somewhere without the heating on, in the cold, a little hat, shivering, <laughs> use my tweets which is gonna make my Twitter account far more fun into a turn. It's almost as if he's playing a character and this whole thing is just a sketch. It's even more emboldened when you realize that he gives commentary on some obvious things in a dramatic way. Here are some examples. The main difference between having a shower and on a plane or on the ground is that when you have a shower on a plane, You're in the air. Think about it. Technically, I'm flying right now. Whereas if I was having a shower on the ground, I wouldn't be flying. I think they have some kind of power. Oh, well, I'll go sleep with the guy. You didn't f the guy. Uh -huh. The guy, you. The same thing. I find myself super funny. <laughs> I find myself super funny.
Yeah, you're probably right. But, but if you also delve deeper into the characteristics of a troll, you can see that he fulfills their criteria as well. Andrew Tate certainly shows off some narcissistic ideas. I've been put on the planet for a very specific reason. Oh, and good. I've been put on the planet to humble you. Tell because oh. all of you people okay. watching this, you will not reach your potential as a man unless you are extremely interested. You must look in the mirror and mm -hmm. you must compare yourself to Tate. And you must understand that you fail Comparing every myself to him. You are poor, you are weak, you are okay. stupid. You are ugly and you are short. You okay. are none of the things I am. Oh, and God, God put me on this planet specifically to remind you of how much you are failing. You are failing the experience of man because I exist <laughs> and only when you accept that and accept your place below me oh? with deep introspection can you find the inner secrets of Wudan and then you are prepared to learn then Bro. you are an empty vessel in which I can entrust my knowledge before that point you're walking around the world going well I have an opinion are you afraid of dying? I wouldn't like Ooh. to die but are you afraid? <laughs> but I, I would like to die I don't want to die so I, I would actually be afraid to die of course because I don't want to die but it is inevitable fair. but why be afraid That's of something that's certainly going to happen will I really die? 50-50 50-50 how would you not die? I've never died let's just well, yeah, but I mean, you're living really now. I know, but I've never died, not even once. So, like, is it really gonna happen? I don't know. It's been a long time. This is guy. Gonna to me? Is it really gonna catch me? I don't know. I'm not sure. I walk into hell, and the devil's what? like, "Oh, I'm gonna burn you." Are you gonna do shit? Imagine I'm in I'm in my fucking six liter B12 Aston Martin Vanquish. Gets about ten miles to the gallon max. I'm sitting there. I'm chilling. He has also shown some psychopathic and sadistic tendencies. You're smart, I'm stupid. We decide oh. to argue. You say two plus two is four, I say two plus two is, is five. You continue okay. to say it's four, I continue to say it's five until I'm enraged. You say, no, it's still four. Now that yeah. I'm enraged, I've decided to rip your arms from your body and f your girlfriend. Who was right? Slap, slap, grab, choke, shut up, bitch, sex. With me, you're gonna learn something. Hey, yeah. I ain't ready for the big man slap. I got a big hand. <laughs> I'll bust their jaw with the bottom of my hand. And the top of their head will feel the sting from the fingers, like the whole BOOM! And as all trolls do, Tate has a fan base so they can listen to his rants, which makes him Machiavellian. Who is Andrew Tate? In geography, my world. In reality, my life. In history, my king. In mathematics, my solution. In mythology, my god. In astronomy, my universe. If I'm blind, he's light. If I'm hungry, he's food. If I'm sick, he's medicine. For me, he's everything. Demetrius and laugh and cheer them both on as they left court. Now let's compare both footages. <laughs> He fits all the descriptions. Another giveaway is how specific his insults are. Like, no genuine person would word it this particular way. And even if you look at the people who watch his compilations on YouTube, their reactions is just to laugh. This guy. <laughs> you could literally argue anything with this guy and he will flip it and turn it and reverse it. Freaking Missy Elliott style. Flip it and reverse. Like you could be like, hey, Andrew Taint. Andrew Taint. The grass is green. And he'll be like, no, actually, uh, I say, I say the grass is purple. So it's purple. Uh, no, actually, I'm looking at it and, and it's green. You're an idiot. I'm rich. I'm more powerful. I f more women. So I say the grass is purple. What are you going to do about it? I say the grass is purple. So what? Andrew, I don't know how to argue. Like, I can, see, we could can both see it right there in front of us. It's green. How about I rip your f face off, put it on my face, do a whole Hannibal Lecter situation, and then I'm you, and I say the grass is purple, which means in so facto means you said the grass is purple. Now who wins? What are you, a little bitch? Jeez. This is my Andrew mother tape. You're okay. button up shit. I'll okay. walk into the fucking most premier establishment you can name with my uh -huh. shirt unbuttoned. Every bitch in their nose, I cheat. What the f Okay, so- Fat, <laughs> ugly, sack of shit. Go to a poor country, no one's depressed. If they have food and their family members are alive, they're all laughing and dancing. Africans ain't even got roofs on their houses. Every time you fucking look at a documentary, they all stop dancing around. I ain't dancing around like that ever. I'm never that happy. What the fuck are you happy about? 
Alright, so there's very little that I actually believe in <laughs> when it comes to Andrew Tate. Are you serious right now, bruh? Bro, Tate is not gonna do the honky donkey with you, bruh. You can't be serious. You gotta be kidding me. Let's see how the replies. Well, I guess uh, all of this is redundant now as Andrew Tate is no longer an internet personality. There are plenty of responses made to him and they have pretty much taken care of everything. This video I actually found was funny and this person called him the incel king. You know, when I think of super manly men, I actually think of people that bully parents with sick children. Like, how did he know? How did he know? Like, Tate, my dude, you say that wasting your time cooking a meal is stupid, but you've got time to pull this kind of shit? Are you just so pathetic that you have to demand parents of sick kids to grovel to you? 